Now, school sports often have a way of bringing communities together during trying times. And teams from four schools in the region will be facing each other tonight in playoff games, but they are certainly doing so with heavy hearts. New Center means David Guildford is at one of those schools <clears throat> tonight. Bonnie Eagle. Hi, David. Hi, Amanda and Zach. It's been less than a week since the shooting, and towns impacted by the violence are beginning to seek healing together. That's what this is here tonight, masquerading as a game. Tuesday is an odd day for a football game. It is a, it is a really good day for football. Friday's high school games were postponed by Wednesday's mass shooting, a shooting that took Peyton Brewer-Ross, a 2001 Westburg High grad, and Josh Seal. Bonnie Eagle, class of 2006. With heavy hearts, both schools prepared for crucial games. Where do we need more tape? Right here, probably. And prepared to honor their neighbors. As um, soon as I saw the picture, I'm like, oh, yeah, I remember Peyton. And the 16 other victims. Just having people together, doing something positive. Um, and so that's what, that's what I'm most excited about for the game. Every ticket sold at Westbrook and Bonnie Eagle Tuesday benefits the families of the people lost from the two towns. Other schools, some with their own loss, others showing solidarity, turned sports this week into community healing. I'm hoping we all come together, both sides, and, you know, pay this tribute to Peyton. I mean, we're going to, you know, donate the gate money to his family. I think that's important. And those who put in this extra work can rest well tonight. I'm honored to be able to be able to put this out on the field uh, for him and for the family and for you know Lewiston as a whole. It's just words on a sign, just lines on a field, and just a football game on a Tuesday night. But sometimes things mean much more. And after tonight, all eyes turn to Lewiston. The Blue Devils' annual rivalry game with Edward Little just across the bridge was postponed to Wednesday. We can expect a powerful scene there, but the scene here tonight is far from over. Amanda, Zach. David, thank you for your report. Certainly some emotional scenes at both of those, and I bet tomorrow will be packed for that Lewiston-Auburn game. That it will.